Chapter 19 Play and Time Curiosity is a sign of health in man and in animal. When learning, do not have any intention of being correct, do not act well or nicely, do not hurry as this creates confusion. The ability to learn a skill such as right-left orientation needs the childish state of mind. That ability to play while learning to pay attention without intending to learn. It also needs, among other requirements, the ability to feel differences. That is, the ability to distinguish between one sensation and another very similar one. It needs attention with intention. The child does not exercise in the sense a grown-up does by repeating an action in order to improve it. The child's attention is directed by curiosity, which is innate in all living things. Repetition in a small child is more often due to the pleasure the act evokes and to its novelty than to any intent to improve. This state of mind goes together with total satisfaction of oneself and excitement and the absence of desires which tense the body and the spirit. The simple mood, posture, and movement are conditions for learning, which is also growth. For successful learning, we must proceed at our own rate. Babies repeat each novel action clumsily at their own rate until they have had enough of it. This occurs when the intention and its performance are executed so that they are just one act, which feels like an intention only. When one becomes familiar with an act, speed increases spontaneously and so does power. Processes go well if there are many ways to influence them. We need more ways to do what we want than the one we know, even if it is a good one in itself. <laughs>